Welcome to the Fox 17 Rock and Review on the web. Uh, this week we're checking out the products of Creation Audio Labs, which have been around since 2003. They're made here in Hermitage in the Nashville market. So we've got uh, Mike and Skip and Sarge over there uh, building some great products. And so what we're, we're looking at right here on the table, first of all, what they're very well known for are the Redeemer products. And the concept with the Redeemer products, such as uh, the original one, which is actually built into your guitar, bass, you know, whatever instrument you're using, you can build this into the circuitry, is to keep your signal true, even after you've got long cable runs, you've got pedals, whatever else, where we all start losing signal. This is designed to keep that signal going. And then they came out also with the belt pack of the Redeemer which uh, this model clips in your back pocket or wherever, and then you run your instrument through that to keep your signal up. And then one of their newest additions over here from Creation is the uh, plug-in, sort of like a direct box for the Redeemer pedal, uh, to where you can actually put it on your pedal board and uh, use that to keep your signal clean and true so you don't lose so much. You start losing your highs and, and mids and everything, as we all do with cables and pedals. Now, uh, in the realm of pedals, one of their very popular models is right here, the MK4, and this is a boost pedal um, that a lot of musicians here locally leave in line and actually leave on all the time to just boost their signal uh, within their pedal board. And it sounds great. I think what was very impressive when I was using this was um, it doesn't color the tone any. So you've got a, you just gotta have a boost uh, where you need it. Like if you're soloing or whatever, or you've got a rhythm section that comes up, you can kick this in and not worry about it just uh, overdriving the sound, which I think a lot of boost pedals do, at least the ones I've used in the past. And the construction is great on this thing with the, with the metal, and they've actually got the screws on the bottom so you can bolt it onto your, uh, to your pedal board, which is very impressive. And then uh, last but not least, uh, the, the pedal I'm actually plugged into over here is the Holy Fire, which is a distortion and overdrive. It's got a great sound to it, um, besides uh, being made out of the metal as well. Uh, it, it has the LED that flashes as you play. You can mix your overdrive or distortion and your gain and get some great tones, whether you're looking for light bluesy tones or you're doing metal or whatever sound in between. I think it's great with slide as well. So I've tried it with a lot of different uh, guitars and, and uh, amps to get different sounds. But if you want to check out more with the Creation Audio Labs, go to their website at creationaudiolabs.com. And uh, I think you're going to like what you see and, and try them out. They've got some new stuff coming out, including uh, uh, Pedal Power, uh, which works well with Pedal Train products. And uh, they've got a lot of new things they're rolling out. They're very progressive. And I think it's more of a pro audio um, take on pedals instead of just putting out a lot of pedals. They are doing them by hand here locally in the Nashville, Tennessee market, which I think is awesome. So let's take a listen now to the Holy Fire. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 